All right, looking at five and six, wanting us to um, quickly do um, identification if we have an R and uh, S and answermers and dystermers using just names. So on uh, five, I want to notice that that part of the name, both those two molecules, is exactly the same. We have the uh, trichloroheptane where it's still two, three, and four. All right, now what we're looking at on the numbers or the, the uh, um, rest is that they are fully mirrored of each other. So I have the 2R, or the 2S becomes 2R, the 3R becomes 3S, and the 4S becomes 4R. So all three are reversed. So since they are all reversed, these are enantiomers. Now, follow that up with set, number six. If I had one of the enantiomers, I am going to reverse both those. But if I want a dystermer, same up here, if I had one a dystermer, reverse one, leave at least one of the same, and uh, don't touch anything else. Since this thing only has two um, centers to get one of my dystermers, we're going to just reverse one of those centers. And then to get the other one, we leave one the same, the other one in this case, and reverse the other. Now, if I, now go back up here for five. If I wanted to do the dystamers up here, I actually leave all the name the same. I just have to reverse at least one thing. So if I uh, go S, R, R, I've made at least one dystamer. And we can mostly do that one just by names. So as long as you reverse one of those letters, you have made a dystermer.